This is our city called Biotopia. And, well, here it is, obviously. And here is the lake where we derive all of our water. And here is a dam that stops the lake from overflooding all of us. And it actually derives energy, uh, hydro hydropower, from the flow of water. And it goes in here, and here are solar panels all over our laboratories to extract energy from the sun, because why not? And into the and then it goes into here, under this bridge, into the water purification center. Which is right here. Flip this lever and it water purification. And it goes all the way right here to people's homes to have and into the farm. Right over here. The farm has wheat, potato, carrot, and yeah, that's it. And after the farmers harvest all their crops, they can put their crops in here, flip this, and the, and it goes into the laboratories and the people to harvest. And here are trees for the people. No, not really for the people, but like trees uh, for the um, ecosystem, for the animals to live in. And here are houses for the farmers, I think. Yeah, farmers. Houses for the miners. Right there, the mine, the mines, or the mountains. Yeah, we go. We use the. We go to the mountains to get ores, such as here. Where are they? Oh, right here. Coal, iron, gold, diamond, emeralds, and more. So we can put them here. Flip this lever, and it goes into the mainland. And here are they, the mountains, and. Also, here are some wind turbines where we harvest energy from the wind. And here they are. And here are some animals around here. These sheep are extremely hungry and look, he's eating grass. And he just regained his wool coat. Maybe the other sheep will too, eventually. So, he just did. And... The other one, okay. Oh no, what is this? Wolf! They're eating the sheep! No! The, this is called predator and prey relationship. Oh no, this wolf is eating this sheep too. Look at it with the dem demon eyes. And look, they turn so cute after they eat the sheep. Isn't that cute? Oh no, he's eating that sheep too. A uh, predator prey relationship. Oh no. Maybe this wolf would like to eat the sheep too. Come on, sheep. Sacrifice yourself for the science project. Come on. Eat him! Oh! Maybe not- Oh yes, now! Oh, that's so cute. Anyways, so here is our predator pay relationship. The sheep eats the grass and gains energy, and then the wolf eats the sheep and gains energy. And he's the apex predator in this ecosystem, so... Once he dies, he decomposes. Eat him. Technically, kinda. Okay, let's check out the labs. We already saw the water purification center. And here is... The biotechnology lab. So, we just invented a new cloning machine. For, these are our um, scientists. They're kind of weird and have long heads, but don't question that. Let's move along. Oh god. Let's move along. If you flip this lever, new sheep will pop up. See, there's only like two sheep right now. There's a third sheep. It cloned it. Again? Oh, and it cloned it again. Mmm, fabulous scientists. Hmm. And also, this machine. Or thing, yeah. You get this, you get this, get rid of this wheat, you plant the seeds, then you use our magical fertilizer, can't see the name, maybe, and then you plant it and it instantly grows, yay! And it also works on trees, let's give an example. Oh, I forgot, here's a super, we extracted some, uh, we extracted some layers from outside, as you, I think you saw it when I was walking along, it's like behind the mountains. It's like a big explosion. Yeah, right there. And we extracted some layers. And here are our layers from um, ages and stuff. Okay, let's try this on trees. So let's plant a tree maybe here. Yes. Oh no, we chopped down a tree. We have to replant it. Don't worry. Oh, it's popped up. Magical. Okay, here is the um, rich houses where like the scientists live in. They have many beds for their many children. 
and there's a bed for them and the wife, and there's chests and stuff to keep their stuff. There's a furnace or oven, whatever you call it. They're all the same uniform, so nobody fights. And here is the farmer's houses, or peasant houses, however you want to like them, however you want to call them. Here's the doors. Chest, clock, oven, furnace thing, bed, just for the f uh, farmers. And if you're a successful farmer or a miner, you can live here. Kind of cramped, but... Uh, chest, a bed for your son or girl or whatever, daughter, and if, yeah, and stuff, and clocks. And, yeah, here is our farm, as I showed, in the trees, and the mining center. Here, look at this. So, oh, we received our shipment, yay, we take our stuff. Bye-bye now. They just go away, We. Here's our disease lab. So, as you can see, these animals are encaged. This is an imported animal, and so is this. So is this, because they don't... They're not natural animals. We keep them in captivity so they don't go off and ruin the ecosystem. So, here. Let's bring some... Uh, disease, I guess. They are able to survive, to survive the disease. Some of them are actually immune. Look at this. This big, this pig, doesn't even get hurt in this poison. And this sheep doesn't get hurt either. Maybe. This cow doesn't get hurt either. This horse. Oh, this horse doesn't like it. Okay, now it wants some. No, see, it gets hurt. Sadly. See, look, you can see his health going down. But he will not die from it. As you can see, he's slowly dying. Slowly dying from the hearts. But no, he stays at half, half heart. And he will not die. He will not die. He will prevail through this disease. We genetically engineered them to be able to survive like that. Oh, it's raining. How wonderful. And it's night, too. But there's light and stuff, so you can kind of see. And yeah, these are energy sources, and yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye now.